comics, uh, <laughs> books, and all kinds of other things coming up next. <laughs> Adrian. And you're watching new comics preview at Emerald City Comics. Once again, we're back. And we've got stuff to talk about. Big week. Uh, so, Free Comic Book Day is normally every May. That rhymed. I should do it all the time. Uh, but it didn't happen this time because of Corona. Um, and people were kind of freaking out about it. Uh, rightfully so. But guess what? It's happening. What? Yeah. And when? it's not going to be a day. Is it going to be... It's going to be the free comic book summer. What? 2020. Um, I'm not 100% sure when it starts, but uh, essentially what's going to be happening is that we're going to be getting uh, like five or six titles every week for like a certain number of weeks. So there's going to be free comics all the time. I don't know. Certain comic book shops might be accumulating all the books and then doing a special day. Uh, we, we might be releasing them every week. Not 100% sure exactly how that's going to work, but we're going to have tons of free comics this summer, okay, for you. Uh, so all those really cool, so so Marvel, a lot of times they'll they'll put actual important stories in their free comic books. Like they do with uh, uh, Secret Empire. That was yeah, one. Secret Empire <laughs> stuff, uh, the uh, Absolute Carnage last year, mm -hmm. they, they did something in that. Uh, there was going to be important stuff in this Spider-Man, I think X-Men, there was all going to be important stuff, and they're like, crap, what are we, we going to do? So they're releasing them. And we're going to have tons, tons of free stuff. So anyway, free comic book day. That's happening. It's going to be free comic book summer this year, uh, this summer. You can get more information about that. We're going to talk about it more when we get more info. And right. you can see all of that on our Facebook. That's right. Uh, if you're not subscribed to us, do that now. Right. So you can get information about upcoming stuff like free comic book summer. That's right. That's a good point. <laughs> Follow us on Facebook, Instagram. Subscribe to us on YouTube. Like this video. And comment it. And follow us on Spotify. Spotify. You guys we use Spotify? have a new comics preview Spotify playlist. That's true. Uh, all the songs that we've used throughout all of our videos uh, are on this playlist. There yeah. might be some that you've heard and you're like, oh, I wonder what song that is. You can see all of those songs yeah. in the description below to the link to the thingy in the bottom. So yes. just go down there, click show more, click on that. And follow it because we're going to keep it updated with some songs we might put some of our favorites on there some songs for you guys yeah yeah it's essentially the soundtrack to new comics preview and it's all on spotify for your listening pleasure so yeah you know, if you wanted another layer of new comic preview awesomeness that's a thing uh video game stuff see i was gonna use speaking of soundtracks and rhythms of music <laughs> kingdom hearts 2020, a little trailer that came up a few days ago that has information about the Kingdom Hearts mobile game, Union Cross, and Kingdom Hearts Union X Dark Road. Cool little, like, Cree stories. Uh, the Kingdom Hearts soundtrack, Kingdom Hearts 3 soundtrack, is going to come out in fall, uh, worldwide release, and it's probably going to be a vinyl for that. I'm excited. Yeah, you guys like Kingdom Hearts? <laughs> and the Kingdom Hearts... Melody uh, by Memory, something like that. It's a rhythm game. Some people aren't excited for it. Rhythm. I'm excited for it. Yeah. Cool. Um, cool, 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 cool. It looks really cool. It's like 100 and something songs, 140 songs on that thing. And uh, songs from Kingdom Hearts, yeah. songs from Disney, all yeah. of that good stuff. Looks really fun. <clears throat> it's very cute and fun. Music. Um, lots of music. Speaking of music. Lots of music. Speaking of music and movies. And Bill. Uh, <laughs> and Ted. They uh, Bill and Ted. Save the world. Yeah. Keanu Reeves and... <laughs> Alex Winter. Yeah, the other guy. Um, <laughs> they are doing it. Again, they're doing another Bill and Ted's movie uh, <laughs> for some reason. Please and uh, good. And, you know, I saw the trailer. I think the trailer <laughs> came out like a week or two ago, something like that. Uh, but, uh, you know, it looks funny. It looks funny. There wasn't a whole lot that they showed or whatever. And um, I feel like... They laid out just enough of the plot so yeah. we know that it's like them trying to save the world for the song that they didn't do. Right, um, right, 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 right. Uh, it looks funny. Uh, I'm going to I'm gonna see it. You know what I mean? Whether it's good or not, I'm going to definitely see it. Um, there was another movie trailer that I saw. There was a bunch of movie trailers that I saw today, 
and uh, they were all, I mean, some of them were kind of cool, whatever, but there was one that, that really stood out to me, uh, and it was Marana, Marona's Fantastic Tale. Uh, it's a French movie, and it's an animated movie. Uh, very artistic, styly, uh, kind of looks like it might be sad, but also, like, I don't know, cool. Uh, very so artistic. It's essentially looking. like a dog's life flashing before her eyes, uh, and you're following all that, you know, from when she was born and to when she dies or something. Anyway, it looks super cute. Check out the trailer. Marona's, Marana's, Fantastic Tale, something along those lines. Uh, I loved it. I thought it looked really cool. I'm excited about it. I'm not excited about the subtitles. So I'm not a sub guy. I'm not a sub guy. Uh, and so, anyway, uh, moving on, moving on. Movies, video games, it's all mixed in together. <laughs> Cyberpunk 2077. The game that will never come out. Yeah, but you know what is coming out? It's a comic. Oh. They're doing a comic of comic or uh, of Cyberpunk 2077. And uh, that's coming out, <laughs> allegedly, in September. Uh, they had to push the game back again. It was supposed to be April. It's and then they moved it to September. September. Now it's in November. November. So we'll see so how, that, how that works. Um, what I heard is that, okay, so it'll be out in November, but also in 2021, it's going to be free. What? Yeah, yeah, they're going to release it for free if you've got a PS4 or uh, Xbox One and all that stuff. Uh, so that's pretty exciting. Uh, there's also going to be a stream unveiling all this information on the 25th, June 25th. Uh, which I don't know what day that is, but uh, you know, look it up, look at a calendar. It's gonna be fine. Uh, but yeah, Dark Horse is gonna do a comic on uh, Cyberpunk uh, 2077. So if you're interested in any of that, sign up. Speaking and of comics, oh, what were you gonna say? You eventually, gonna say there's been like listings for it and stuff. But we haven't got it. Yet. They're doing another like a reboot of the Cyberpunk RPG. Oh, so we're definitely gonna be getting that dang, when it comes man. out. Yeah, Cyberpunking it up. <clears throat> Uh, you know, it might be 2077 before we actually get any of this stuff. By the time that happens, we might have a zombie apocalypse. And it'll just be cyberpunk contemporary. Yeah. Uh, anyway. Zombie apocalypse, though. Oh, that's true. That's true. It's possible. We could be way... Anyway, doesn't matter. You know who I want on my team in a zombie apocalypse? Who? Negan. Negan? Does he live? But he's dead, right? Negan lives! He's alive! He's alive! <laughs> so July 1st. The year is going to be a comic called Negan Lives. Out on the shelves, this is a, uh, a gift from Robert Kirkman. He thought, what uh, what better way to give back to the comic shops and comic book fans than, uh, you know, producing a comic. Where he lives. <laughs> are we going to get variants of figures? Uh, we are. We are oh, going to get some variants. Uh, there's going to be this really, really cool uh, Negan Lives cover, and that's going to be the one that everybody gets. But also, there's going to be a silver version and a gold version as gold. well. Yes, I think each store gets two silvers and one gold, something along those lines. Won't be able to reserve those, so the only way to get those <laughs> is to be here July 1st at 11 a.m. Uh, first come, first serve on that. They'll be on the table. Um, okay, it's comic... Power lightning round. Cause we got a bunch. Let's go. Ready? Okay. Go, 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 go. Okay. Couple of couple of hot ones to mention right now. Power Rangers number fifty. This is a big, 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 big issue. Uh, if you've been reading the uh, comic, if you haven't, you definitely want to grab this. Either way, because it's a uh, anniversary issue. Lots of covers. Really, really cool. Next, Texas Blood Partner. That, that Texas Blood. Uh, I read this one. Definitely, I'm super excited about it. I really, really liked it. It's uh, sort of like uh, No Country for Old Men, but it's got a supernatural feel to it. It's it's a it's a work of art, is really what it is. Next, where is the where are the other drugs? <laughs> Batman. Batman, Batman ninety three uh, on the road to the Joker War. Uh, Really cool Matina cover of Harley, and uh, of course the A cover is really really cool. Gonna want to grab that. We're gonna have a ton on the shelf. Keeping it with DC, we got Green Lantern 80th Ooh, anniversary special. We've got all the decades, all the covers. You'll see them on the shelves Wednesday. Uh, and then on the Marvel side of things, we've got Empire Avengers. Ember Avengers Empire. This is another one that's <laughs> leading up to the big uh, Empire event, which is spanning the whole Marvel universe. So you got. The Skrull, Skrull, and you got the Kree. Kree. They hate each other. <laughs> They're always fighting each other, and we're sort of sometimes caught in the middle, sometimes we pick a side, doesn't really matter. Uh, this time, they're joining forces to fight Earth, and we don't know why. We don't know. But we do know that they are led by a Kree Skull 
hybrid. Oh, Something that see. combines the best of both worlds to destroy us. Yep, yep. How do you keep your enemies as close as possible? You breed with them. Who's going to stop this enemy of theirs? Uh, it, who knows? Who knows? I mean, we got Avengers uh, 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 Empire coming out uh, Wednesday. We've also got the Road to Empire. Uh, that's on the shelves right now. You can grab that at any time. Uh, but anyways, we got tons of other comics that are on the shelves this week. Let's go check them out. Let's go check them out right now. <laughs> It's Batgirl, number 46, or take Cool Variant. In here, Clee Variant, grab that thing. And next uh, to Batgirl is Batman 93. We've got the A cover there. We've got a nice healthy stack, but a, a gigantic stack of this sweet Matina variant here. Uh, yeah, come grab this Batman 93 Wednesday. New one from Vault. This one is a ninja vampire tale called Bleed Them Dry. Avengers Empire number zero. We've got a uh, action figure variant there, and this is kicking us, uh, kicking our Empire event off. We've also got Road to Empire right next to that. If you haven't started it, definitely want to grab this bad boy Wednesday. Bye. Dead Body Roadman number one. We've got two healthy stacks of the Green Lantern 80th Anniversary 100 page Super Spectacular with all of the variants all through the decades, 1940s, 1950s, I like that one a lot, uh, the 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s, 2000s, and 2010s, and there's a Green Lantern blank <laughs> variant as well right there. Bam, 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 bam. Come grab all of these tomorrow, which is Wednesday. Harley Quinn and the Birds of Prey, number two. Hmm, the Immortal Hulk, number 34. Hey, remember Joker Killer Smile? Yeah. Remember that series? That was a cool one, right? Yeah. Well, right next to that, <gasps> it's Batman the Smile Killer. <laughs> Yes, it's the continuation of this insane story. Speaking of insane, Bats is looking pretty crazy there. Uh, get Batman the Smile Killer Wednesday. <laughs> it's Justice League. First up, Justice League number 47 with a cool variant of the uh, team. That's pretty dope. And then Justice League Dark number 23, also with a cool variant of the team. <laughs> Very cool. Once and future number eight. It's back, y'all. It's monstrous number twenty-eight. Mighty Morphin Power Rangers number fifty on the shelf Wednesday. We've got these two cool covers. They connect. Wait, wait. Hold them next to each other. Uh, what? Okay, <gasps> they're side by side. Look, they're touching hands. That's pretty cool. So get both of those. And then there's this cool FOC cover. <laughs> and then... Shiny. Shiny. It's a shiny wraparound. Shiny. Look. It's like a mirror. Shiny twin. It's like, it's like a mirror. Come get these Shiny twin covers all Wednesday. It's Rescue 2020 number two. Sweet cover there. Morty, 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 we got it, Morty. <laughs> oh, it's me. Rick and Morty presents Council of Ricks on the shelves Wednesday. It's Rogue Planet number two. Look at that gory cover. Uh, <laughs> new one from Stephen King and Owen King. It's Sleeping Beauties. Horror comic, if you are interested, come grab it Wednesday. Butterflies. No, are those moths? Moths. I hate moths. Moths. This comic is called Support Our Shops. It's got a bunch of uh, really cool stories on the inside, and it's uh, from Aftershock Comics. Uh, come grab this bad boy uh, Wednesday. This is sort of a one-of-a-kind one of a kind sort of deal that Aftershock did specifically for comic shops. Right next to that is Spawn number 307. We've got some tasty covers for that. We've got that one there and that one there. And then we've got the virgin version of the other cover there. So grab all of these Wednesday. Peter Parker, the spectacular Spider-Ham number five. It's Mojo. Star Wars, Star Wars Bounty, Bounty Hunters number three. 
Turtles, you understand? Turtles. We got a bunch of new turtles on the show Wednesday. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the ongoing series number 105. We got the cover A and the cover B by Kevin Eastman. Definitely want to grab your hands on that. Also, right next door is the conclusion to the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Jenica mini series. Very, very cool stuff. Grab it Wednesday. Year Zero, number two. Thor, number five. Valiant, buy it. And then next to that, we got a new one from Image. It's That Texas Blood. You heard us talk about that in the uh, in the little preview one beforehand. Yeah, man. Uh, we got a cool variant for that, so uh, yeah. come on up and pick that bad boy up right now. Why not? Come on, no, no. <laughs> Books, books. He said books. What time is it? Why? Books. It's book time, and we got a full new book wall right here for your uh, uh, bookie, bookie pleasure or whatever. Uh, let's see what we got up top. We got the new volume of Ascender. That's volume two, trade paperback. We got the new volume of Angel from the Buffy universe. That's volume two as well. Uh, what do we got over here? Speaking of volume twos, it's Doomsday Clock. The volume two hardcover. This is the uh, second half of the Doomsday Clock miniseries. Uh, what's cool about this one is that uh, you buy the book, part two, and I'm assuming you've already bought part one. Otherwise, why would you be buying part two? I don't know. But uh, if you bought the part one, you get this cool little box to house it all in. So you get the cool slipcase, hardcover uh, slipcase. You get volume two. You can put your volume one right in there and you're good to go. Display it for all the jealousy of all your friends. That's available Wednesday. We also have John Wick, the trade paperback. Now this already came out in hardcover form, but now it's in trade paperback, so it's a little bit cheaper, so that's pretty cool. And then finally, we also have the next edition of Marvel Action Spider-Man. You got Miles, you got Spider-Gwen, you got Venom. What else does anybody really need, honestly, in life? They I mean, need more books. More books? Well, guess what? All of these and more are available on a wiggity 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 books. books? Wednesday. Wednesdays. Hey, you know what'd be really cool? If, what you know what we should do? Uh books. Mm. We did that. Comics? Yeah. No, how about no. <gasps> Well, hello there. Thank you for joining us on this incentive variant uh, evening. Uh, wow, there's a massive glare coming off of these, but that's okay, because look at this table, man. It's hey. filled with incentive variants. We were eyeballing this uh, Terminator Transformers variant where the Terminators seem to be coming out of Optimus Prime there. That's pretty wacky. Uh, these uh, are from previous weeks, but we just thought we'd keep them up there just for the lulls. Uh, because they're super hot. But for the new week, we've got a Bounty Hunters. We've got an Avengers Empires. Couple of Sleeping Beauties variants there. We got a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Turtles. We got a Thor. We got a Power Rangers Fitty. You look like a turtle. We got that Transformers Terminator. All of these are only available here at Emerald City Comics, and they're only available Wednesday. Wiggity, wiggity, Wednesday. So if you're interested in any of these, definitely want to be here at 11 a.m. bright and early. Well, it's not really early, and it may or may not be bright. I don't know, but it's going to be 11 a.m., and you're going to want to grab these before they go, because once they're gone, they're gone forever. Never. Did you know that? Wednesday. They're gone. So come in Wednesday and get them all. <laughs> so, Frank, we got... I don't want to play anymore. I'm going that way. Oh. Wow. 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 <laughs> Wow, man, that was pretty nuts. Uh, right? that, was a, that was a good week uh, coming up. Yeah, it was yeah, a lots huge of good week. Stuff. Lots of good stuff. Uh, we got Batman 93, yeah. Green Lantern, yeah. 80th anniversary, uh, Birds of Prey. Birds. Uh, Birds of Prey. I'm a bird. Uh, Empire Avengers. Punchline. Uh, pu punch, 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 punch. Yeah, Punchline stuff, and uh, really just all kinds of really cool stuff. Um, and it's all for you. You. Yes, you. For you! Don't look around. I'm talking to you specifically. Just a ton of stuff like we do every single week. It just the party never ends. Never. Never ends. Never it's just ends. Just constantly happening. Every Here at Emerald City, we've got the variants on the table. We've got new books. We've got new comics. We've got toys, games, all of that stuff. Toys? Um, yeah, toys. Yes, there are new toys. Yeah, um, tons of new toys. You're not new, though. I've been here for. But look at the articulation on this guy. Seriously, look at this. His individual fingers? Like, are you kidding me? Who yeah. needs that? I don't know. I do. Ew. He bends in such a weird way. Look, look at his face. Hmm. 
That's my cousin. Hmm, I'm done. I'm done with this place. Bye. <laughs> anyway, uh... <laughs> I'm offended by that. Well, I don't have anything else to say. Do you, uh, Mr. Hawkman Wolverine guy? Hey, hey, uh, justice! But no, I got nothing. No, no, nothing yeah, else? Nothing else. Okay, well, I hope to see you all here on Wednesday. And I hope to see you here... Saturday. <laughs> uh, that's right. And so, uh, I don't know. I, I usually say something at the end here. Do you want to you take us home, Mr. Cape Man? Just remember, wherever there's a villain or a crime... Hawkman, not licensed Hawkman me. It's going to be there. I have Wolverine claws. Okay, goodbye. Also, good night and